Well, 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 what's going on? So, as you can see, we have Robot Arena 2. This is one of my favorite games of all time. In order for me to play this, I have to basically run it on Windows 7 64 bit. Um, absolutely no emulators. This is direct from a original CD copy. And I'm here to explain what this game is. And if we want for it to continue to be a series, I hope you subscribe. And if this thing gets at least 10 likes, just 10, just 10, I think I'll go ahead and continue it if that's the case. Anyways, so uh, let's get on with it. So obviously you have every piece of good information. It does not run in full. It runs only in full screen, not widescreen. Uh, it's that old. Um, let me just go ahead and set this to a watch cam. Uh, you can really max this game out. I'm getting 150 frames while recording, to say the least. This is very low graphics, it's simple. Um, I'm just going to leave everything on, except for the music, because uh, I don't know if there's any any uh, copyrights on there. Um, but yeah. Now. We have three modes, Exhibition, Team HQ, and Multiplayer. The multiplayer is via internet or LAN, if you still have the connections and you have somebody else to play with, which is great. Yeah, you can create your own game, you can join and do, do, do whatever. And you can also have custom maps for this, which is amazing how many maps there are. Anyways, so let's get into Exhibition. Exhibition is basically where you can choose what you want to do. Like, I'm going to choose... Deathmatch. Then you can pick your arena. These are all stock arenas. I personally really enjoy uh, the compressor arena because it reminds me a lot of the old, old, you know, robot arena stuff. Or not, ro well, not robot arena in particular, but you know, battle bots. Actually, this is total battle bots. Let's go with that. And you can of course choose whether you're a person or a machine. I'm gonna choose machine for my opponent. I'm gonna have it. Ooh, I don't like the good old boys. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go with. We're gonna start with lightweight fights, so you can see how this thing works out. Um. Yeah, it's good. Berserker is a good light. Um, uh, good lightweight to start with. And as you can see, I have a whole bunch of random teams. If I go into my primary, here's my lightweight Zippo. I don't remember his control, but we're gonna hope for the best. If you never remember the controls, hit F1 and you can automatically see bot controls reminder and then you have your different cameras like an orbit camera. So if you have somebody else with you, you can actually have them work with, work the cameras and also multiplayer chat, which is very nice. So as you can see, it is robots and they fight. So be it Zippo here is probably not going to have much of a chance because this guy's too heavy. I can't move. Unstuck me, thank you. Wow, losing on the very first video, huh? Nice, nice job, big one. Nice job, buddy. Yeah, I'm gonna lose it. So I'm, I'm gonna lose it, big one. Just go out spinning. But yeah, that's the basics of Robot Wars, and you can. A Robot Wars, what am I saying? Robot Arena! And of course, if you want to, you can make unfair matches like I can set one of my biggest and one of my best robots out there against him. Um, I'll send Gristle up against Berserker, which is totally unfair. Time to kick this match into gear. You can design your own robots, which makes it a little bit more fun. As you can see, these are all custom, like, mine's a custom design. Oh! Ooh! Oh, you're gonna get it. Oh, you're going to get it. You are going to get it. Oh, you little... <clears throat> okay. You little thing. The wing ding. I'm just going to flip you over and leave you there. You're done. You can't move, so automatically you get disqualified. 
Yeah, that's the rules in this. If you can't move, um, you get disqualified. So you have to be very careful as to how you create your robots. Like this one can get flipped over fairly easily because of its weapon. As you saw, this little guy's got quite a bit of power, but I win anyways. This match is done! As was stated by this guy. And this screen. So, that's the basics of that. Now, I'm gonna take you through a brand new team. So, let's see. Um, we got the new team button. It allows us to make, of course, a new team. For this one, I'm gonna call it Q plays. You make it. I play it. And then you can select your different icons. Of course, you can import more. But it has to go. You have to add a little bit of extra code into it. I'm just gonna pick a uh, pirate play. Be awesome. Now here, um, I'm going to get into this in another video. I'm just going to import another robot that I've already previously made. And for us, that means it's time for a break. And also, if I get those 10 likes, I will post the next video, which is basically how to uh, create your own robot. Also, fair to note that I will also quick show you how to import. It's super simple. And we'll continue on from there. All right. If that's all right with you, I'll see you next time. Goodbye! <laughs>